what's up welcome back to my channel so today we have a fun makeup video i'm so excited um i actually ran over to ulta and i purchased a new exciting palette um so we got the goods we got the goods in here so honestly i had seen this palette online and i just I didn't think the promo like the pictures looked that impressive and stuff and I didn't think I was gonna pick it up and then I went in the store to just shop around and look a little bit and I saw the display for this and I had to swatch it and after I swatched it I was like I gotta buy this because it swatched so beautifully the sparkles in here were stunning um, so this is the Rem Beauty Wicked um, this is the Oz Dust eyeshadow palette and I'm so excited to try out today with you guys. The shades in here are actually really, really beautiful. Like I said, the sparkles just like blew my mind and that's when I knew I was like, I have to buy this palette. So here is kind of what the shades look like on the back, but we're going to open it up and dive in and create an eye look today. I think we're going to go more Glinda because that's just the vibes I just love the pink vibes and but I love the greens in here too so maybe we'll have to do like a part two and do a more like alphaba look too um but today I think we're gonna go for more Glinda we'll have to see but I love Ariana and I saw this palette and I was like I think I need it so we're gonna try it out today I'm super excited so let's go ahead and get into the video I already did the rest of my makeup so we're pretty much just focusing on like the eyes and I haven't put on any highlighter yet so good to go there um but this is so pretty it looks like an actual book but it has like pink it looks like actual little pages here so it looks like a book and it has the little tassel it's actually really cool packaging something kind of different you know as one of the little monkeys it has the little air balloon butterflies flowers just really cool little details all over it so it's 12 eyeshadow shades ranging from shade shifting duochromes to rich metallics and velvety mattes inspired by the icy blue crystal tones of the Oz Dust Ballroom, playful pinks from Glinda, and powerful deep greens from Alphaba. It has a mirror on this side. I haven't seen this come with like a palette in quite a while. I know Too Faced used to do this with some of their little palettes and stuff, but it kind of gives you like a guide on like what looks to make, which is actually pretty cool. Like it gives you little ideas on different ones to try, what colors to use, where to put them, that kind of thing. Like a little guide to a look if you don't know what kind of eye look to create, then this kind of helps you decide. I don't think I'm going to use this. I'm probably just going to create my own. So let's go ahead and open it up and look at the actual colors up close. Okay. Do you guys see what I'm talking about with the shimmers? Like they are just stunning. A pretty palette. So I'm going to go ahead and swatch them by row on my hand and like show you guys can you, so you can kind of see the colors a little more up close and then we'll go ahead and get into like an eye look trying them out. So let's go ahead and do some swatches. first shade in the palette I think that I want to start off with is the um, goodness nose and then I'm gonna go in with thrillifying as well um, they're the first two mattes on the top row so these ones I'm gonna put this one like um, just kind of all over through the crease and then the same with the thrillifying I'm gonna kind of layer that and kind of more focus it on the outer area but we shall see just taking it on a really big fluffy just a fluffy brush this one's from elf so we're just gonna put that one everywhere the first shade we're gonna go in now with the thrillifying which is a little more kind of on the peachy side, it looks like. I'm 
kind of add that to like the outer corner and through the crease a little bit. This is all we have going on with like the mats. Pretty simple. Just deepened it up a little bit on the outer corner. And now I think it's time. I really want to let the sparkles shine in this palette. So we got to go in with some sparkle. I have to go with perfectly pink because it's just beautiful. The shimmer next to these two. We're going to go in with the perfectly pink. It just looks so so it's a little flakier of like a formula so let's see it actually looks like it's sticking to the eyes pretty good without like a glitter um, primer or anything wow oh my gosh you guys that is stunning that glitter is stunning oh my gosh I don't know how good these light colors like pick up on my camera, but I'm gonna have to do a, a up close for you all as well. So you can see like just how pretty this is. I think I'm gonna take a little bit of the the whiz shade which is like this icy kind of blue I kind of want to put that in like my inner corner oh yeah good choice good choice Like that just kind of makes the eyes pop. Oh, so pretty. Okay, for under um, my eye, I'm gonna add the Thrillifying shade again, that peachy brown, and just put that um, on my lower lash line. Like, do you guys see the glitter in this? I'm obsessed. Like, actually, so pretty. Okay, guys, I'm going to go ahead and do, like, a thin, like, black line of eyeliner. I'm going to use my L'Oreal Panorama Mascara. The eyeliner is Kaja. And then for my lashes, I think I'm going to go a little on the more dramatic side. These are the Faux Mink 811s by Ardell. Um, the ones on the bottom here. I think we're gonna go with those. So let me go ahead and pop this stuff on and just have our completed eye look. I'm super excited. This is like my glittery dream fantasy. So <laughs> loving it so far. completed look what do you guys think i personally really love it like i could see myself wearing this to work and stuff just like the soft sparkly tones so cute um but i definitely want to do a part two using more of the like alphaba inspired shades like more of the greens like the second row in this palette definitely and maybe even the third like the icy tones are really pretty too but i think that this look turned out super super pretty I'm loving it. It only took three shades, which is pretty cool. So very, very cute, simple, girly fun 
girly pop fun. <laughs> I did end up doing a wing for the eyeliner because I think it, it just went with the look better, I feel like. Um, once I had the lashes on, I was like, I think it needs a little wing. So that's what I did. But anyways, that is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed. I think that the quality of this palette is really, really good. I'm excited to play around with it more. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little Glinda look. Um, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe down below if you haven't already. It means so much to me. I will see you guys in my next one.